Hello my friends, I'm Enoch you know, Petrocelli, a manwich author and channeler. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new to my channel, I welcome you as well. Today I'll be channeling my favorite entity, um, one of my favorite entities, I have to say, Lord Lucifer, the light bearer, and we will be doing um, whatever he wants to do today. I'm going to let him come through. He had some things he wanted to say. So I'm going to let him come through and speak to you guys, all those who follow my work and who follow my channel and my patrons as well. This video is for you and I thank you guys for hanging with me as long as you have. Thank you for watching my videos and definitely I really appreciate all patrons who um, pay for my content. I, it really helps me a lot, supports me and helps me keep the channel going and keep the content coming to you guys. Thank you. So, like I said, today we're going to channel Lucifer. For those interested in my Patreon and um, my other content that I offer, I will leave a link in the description below. Follow me on Instagram, at Enoch Petroselli for my bodybuilding content, and at Melwitch Enoch for my witchcraft and occult-related content. Thanks. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. With all that said, we will get right into this. I invite Lord Lucifer, Father Lucifer, into this channeling session. I invite you to speak through me your messages to those viewers at home watching this video, to my patrons, and to me, Lord Lucifer, Lord of Light, thank you. Our futures are intertwined. The coming new age of sorcery for mankind is becoming more prevalent in the minds of this world. The sorcery, witchcraft, magic of mighty men and women is changing the world clearly. It is having a strong effect on your society. And it is undeniable the ripple effect of such spells and magic sorcery cannot be ignored even by the average person who does not participate in or believe in the aforestated. The wealth of information given out to the world through this channel is to be recognized as valuable in the future. And those who are receiving information from the gods directly on their own are valued by us and by all those who they help. The continuing flow of knowledge and power from the channels who we work through is being directed at those who believe in and who resonate with the particular messages. If the message is not for you, I recommend you do not read into it do not balk at this channel. Do not balk at us. It will do you no good. And it may even cause harm to come to you in the future. As these messages are encoded with specific frequencies that will change you if you do such. Now for the message in particular for those viewing this video who subscribe to this system that Enoch has created. There are several layers of reality that are opening to human consciousness that were not accessible in the past. Those of you who follow these teachings may access these layers of reality through this video 
we will give you instructions on your own time. This video will activate those instructions. If you watch this video, set the intention to receive the instructions now. The instructions being transferred to your unconscious minds will activate when you are in a relaxed receptive state of mind and body. Furthermore, the instructions will activate within your energy bodies. They will automatically upgrade your level of awareness. Your energy bodies will become attuned to the new information, the new layers of reality that I've stated. I will not give more information than that about these particular layers of reality through this video, I will give you more information on an individual basis. Now for some future predictions regarding your economy, your political systems. The world will shift in a direction that is good in the long run, it may appear drastic and even bad, quote unquote, in the short term. Once the shift occurs and the dust settles, people will begin to realize what they had missed, what they had not known about the others who they had been judging as the enemy of their country. Our country is the world. The borders are quite permeable at this time. There are extreme complications with this fact that are being addressed now. Some people view it as a positive and then others understand the complications and see the problem with open borders at all times. There must be regulations in order to prevent these complications in the future. The regulations are not an evil on either side. They are a necessary addition to transitioning from one portion of the world to another. The structures that control borders are necessary and they are needed at this time for your protection from the people who would abuse the honor and privilege of transitioning into your society by harming its citizens and communities with their activities of vile intent. I'm communicating these messages to those who have suffered these things in particular. I do not approve of it. I do not believe that it is right for you to harm the people of other countries. I do not believe that it is right for you to abuse 
the honors that you've been given by these countries, the trust that they have given you to transition into their communities, and yet you dishonor them with hatred, and you abuse their systems. You give them your worst when they've only given you their best. How would you react if it were reversed? Have I made myself absolutely clear? I digress and continue with the predictions. The status of your economy is one step away from a disaster. This disaster is avertable. It is not a definite. It is not an absolute necessity to bring a better future. It is not going to happen the way that people are predicting if you project the right intention into the aeon that is coming project your goodwill towards it goodwill towards the people of this world goodwill towards your country and your economy in your local area the goodwill will allow for the best outcome and give you peace of mind in regards to financial stress and constraints. There is absolutely no reason to be alarmed if you trust our power to flow through you and make the changes that you would desire now, here and now, give it your all, give it your goodwill, give it your blessing and create the best future, not one of financial constraint and poverty. Give it your best outcome. The dramatic and selfish reactions to the wars occurring are unneeded and uncalled for. The wars are happening because we wanted them to in order to break the systems that were causing you to feel complacent and unworthy of who you were. I'm not suggesting that these wars are wrong or right. I'm suggesting that these wars are a collapse of a contained energy, a contained hatred that had to be released. The energy, the hatred, will break the bonds that are containing it. And that is what has occurred. With the energy released, it may dissipate. It may change the face of the earth. However, there will be a good outcome if you trust your own individual intentions and allow it to become a good outcome. Take heed and lay low if you are in the areas that are under attack. I'm not suggesting that this tragedy is a good thing for those who are suffering because of it. There will come a time when there will be greater peace in the world sooner than 
you may believe. Thank you. Thank you, Lucifer. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please like the video and subscribe to my channel for more channelings like this. And don't forget to check out, check out my Patreon for my occult related content that is not uh, available anywhere else. Thanks guys.